Hey, hey, what's up, man? Hey, how's it going? Oh, I see you heading towards the old Trump star, yeah, man. Yeah, I wanted to see it. Yeah, it's all covered up and stuff. Yeah, that's what I heard. I heard that old boy took a pickaxe in that thing. <laughs> he did. He did. <laughs> you know, a lot of people hate him, but you know what? A lot of people like him. Yeah, I, I voted for him. Oh, did you? Well, yeah, the way I look at it is, is that, you know, the U.S. right now, it's being run like a charity, and it should be run right. like a business. Yeah. And that, that's the way I look at it. Okay. And, uh, you know, I'm willing to give the guy a shot. Just to see how... Yeah, he'll kind of, do. I like to shake up things every once in a while and just kind of see how it's going to go. You know, it's kind of funny uh, thinking of you, man. I haven't seen you in a while. I uh, I was at the airport, like, I don't know, about a couple weeks ago. Oh, I love the airport. I knew what this was it. And, the and they know you over there. You're called the airport actor. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> wait, wait, why is that, though? Oh, it, it started years ago. Like, my publicist and I, we get to Sundance early. Okay. You know, a couple days early or so. And then what we end up doing is, is like, I'd have, like, pocketfuls of business cards. And I thought, well, Hell's Bells, there's all these A-listers. And, you know, big names walking right past me. I'll just give them cards and just strike up conversations. And so that's what happened. And then it got kind of be a running joke. Right. You know, and then I'd go to parties up, up topside later, and they'd all rip into me about it and everything. And I'd say, well, yeah, how many business cards do you have left? I've got, like, almost none. Right. Well, you know and what? I'm getting gigs out of it. That's too. what I'm saying. It's, like, it's really not a joke because it's actually benefited you. Sure. And, and, and it works in your behavior. Now, are you going to, are you going to Utah this year? You know, I'm considering it. I don't know. Um, I thought I might have a film up there this year. Okay. But it's kind of, you know, I'm just not real sure yet. Okay. Uh, so far, let's see, lately, as far as the industry stuff, I've been, I, I see, I, I've got to go to a premiere tomorrow on a TV pilot I did called The Good Life. Okay. I play like cool. this crazy mental patient. And for me, being from backwoods, Oklahoma, it's very easy. Okay. And uh, then, let's see, uh, oh, and uh, I had my agent submit me and went in red for a part for a film called Star Bright. Okay. Uh, James Earl Jones, Kathy Bates, yeah. Bryce Davies, uh, Diego Benita from Rock of Ages. And okay. The thing about that is being shot in my hometown, Barbara, Oklahoma. Oh, heck yeah, I love Oklahoma. Yeah, so I was back there and I just walked in and I knew the casting director, so it worked out really well. Okay, man. Well, listen, I know you're doing big things slowly but surely picking it up, and you're an oil man anyway. Yeah, I mean, so. still got a little dribble of production back in Oklahoma. Yeah. Hey, I do want to say something, though. About What's up? Star over here. Yeah. You know, that's just a damn shame because no matter what your political views are, yeah. You know, don't get all radical and do crazy things like that because, you know, know. That's, it's just a waste of money. It's, it's a terrible thing. I have the same problem because I, I live down in South Bay, and I can't leave campaign signs out. It's so different in Oklahoma, you know, because you leave campaign signs out in your yard, they vanish. I've had three vanish in one day. You know, you put a bumper sticker on your car, and your tires are flat, and there's dog poop smeared all over. Right. That's just, that's just wrong, just destroying property like that. I agree. You're all angry. Well, go vent your anger somewhere else. Get a punching bag or, right. or whatever. And this is America. You're allowed to have your opinion no Absolutely. matter what. No that's matter who or no matter, what. No yeah. matter what. Exactly. You know, everyone's entitled to opinion. Exactly. And that's, that's just kind of how I look at it. All right, man. Hey, listen, it's good seeing you again. Hey, it's good seeing you. All right, Thanks man. Have a good one. Yeah. See you later.